Have you ever wished that you could crop an individual layer instead of having to crop the whole image to make something fit? Well, I'm going to show you how to do that. It's really not hard at all. What I have here is I have some screen captures of a website mock-up I did showing a responsive design. And I want to fit them into these uh, tablets on my template here. This uh, tablet and cell phone. Right down the tablet, but I'm going to show you the cell phone. You notice it's a pretty long screen capture here. I captured the entire thing in the entire screen in the responsive display. So we're just going to go ahead and drag that on up and place it right there. And now I'm going to hit Show Transform Controls and I'm going to zoom out some. Just go ahead and bring that up, something like that. Oh. Hold Shift Alt so I can control it from the center. Get it somewhere near the width that I want. Bring it right back down there. From the center again. C control Alt. I mean Shift Alt. So that's getting pretty close. It's time to zoom in. So we can fine tune this. Grab it from the corner here, shift click. Bring it up some more. And again, one more time. I want to get as close as possible to where I want it on the width here. Alright, we go. That's look pretty good. Bump it over a little bit. Hit enter to accept that. Let's turn off the transform controls. If you'll notice, it goes over. If I were to show the transform control, you'll see it goes way on down. But we're not worried about anything that's off the canvas. But this piece right here, we really need to cut out to make this work. Now, you notice if you use the crop tool, You only have the option to crop your entire image. It selects all layers. So I'm going to control Z that, come back. And I'm not going to, don't crop. But what we can do is we can click on the layer. This is our picture layer here that we're wanting to work with. Click on it. We'll add a mask down here at the bottom. We'll add a layer mask. We'll make sure that the box is highlighted in these dashed corners that you see here. And then we're going to grab our marquee tool and we can drag anywhere. Let's see, let's zoom in a little bit so we get a little closer. We're going to say we want it probably cropped from about here down. But I'm going to go a little lower because I want to show you something. You can drag anywhere, it's only going to mess with that that's there so you don't have to be real precise on the width of it. But the height you want to get pretty close. And once you got it selected, hit delete. You'll notice that the, the cell phone controls are still covered up. Well, we can fine tune that by selecting filter. I mean, uh, select, modify, and we're going to expand our selection some. So we're going to expand it by about five pixels. And we're going to hit delete again. You notice it went up. So not enough. So we'll just select, modify, expand. Let's say five more pixels. hit delete that looks about right and that's really all there is to cropping uh, a layer an individual layer you're not really cropping you're using your select tools to delete instead zoom back out to 100 percent and there's my responsive display for more video tutorials visit skeeterz71.com they are all free they cover everything from Website design, Photoshop, Illustrator, Dreamweaver, WordPress, .NET Nuke, all kinds, all kinds of free video tutorials. You have a good day.